Hello everyone. This is Robotics Student Organization, participating in Minus River 2022. I'm Anas Khotari, team leader and control member. In this video, we are going to introduce our technical aspects of our robot. I'm Mariam Saadawi, I'm a mechanical member and robotics organization. We are going to introduce our mechanical specs and proof. We in the mechanical team choose to make a four-wheeled robot. Starting with the base, we made it from L-shaped aluminum angle to give the structure stability and self-damping for vibrations because of elasticity of aluminum. Then we fix the motors to the base by clamps. The chassis of the robot is made of square-shaped aluminum beams covered with 3 mm thick plywood because of its low weight. The robot body is divided into three parts divided on two levels. The first level is for batteries and collected mines, and the second level is left for the control box. Also, the robot has a metal detector made of plywood and an arm made of 6 mm thick plywood that ends with an electromagnet for mine collection. Besides the arm, lies a freewheel with an axe made of 6 mm thick plywood, and there is an encoder mounted on it for mapping. Eventually, we chose high torque DC motors for the robot so that it would be able to maintain the environment of the playground. Hi, I'm Mr. Kusai. Hardware Control Mind Super Member for the Oranges Robotics. We are designing and manufacturing the PCBs for the needle hardware in order to reduce the percentage of error, as well as to facilitate the wiring process. For the metal detector, we have already finished designing and manufacturing the PCB. It's not a prototype, it's a fully completed product which can be used in the market. The mechanical team suggested to use an electromagnet instead of the traditional arm in order to collect the mine. So we designed a special PCB for this purpose. For the powering and protection circuit, it has not finished yet. We are just tuning the schematic and then the manufacturing process will begin. So that's it. And we hope everything is clear and well delivered. Thank you for your time.